back to the channel today we're gonna make some ghost pepper smoked salt that's right easy to do goes good on everything makes a great gift we're gonna need one cup of water and two tablespoons of dehydrated ghost peppers from the garden blitz that up real quick get everything mixed together and watch your fumes on this you might uh, choke a little that's all I'm saying dump in two cups of salt at a time going to use four cups total. Get that blitzed up 15-20 seconds and when you see it good and mixed up go ahead and dump that other cup in there. Let it run while you're mixing this. It'll mix good. It's that easy. Hard part's over. Now I'm going to put it on a parchment covered pan and I wrap the pans in aluminum foil just to make sure they don't ruin my pans. We want to get this thin as much surface area as possible for that smoke. And then straight into the smoker. I'm using a Copperhead 5 pellet smoker set on a smoke setting. I'm going to smoke this for three hours. Then I'm going to come back and check it, stir it around. It should start drying about that time. There you go. Three hours later, you can see the color change from the top compared to the inside of the salt. See that? That's what we want to do. Now, every hour after this for the next five hours, go back and stir it and when you're done this is what you should have all dried salt should be completely dry so I'm gonna scrape it off throw it in a pan grab a potato masher to break up the big chunks and I dumped it in this aluminum pan just to make it easy to transport back in the food processor we want to blitz this 10-15 seconds maybe we don't want to blitz it too much to make all dust but we do want to break up the chunks a little bit so just pulse it a few times to what you like and that's it you'll be surprised how much this smells the house up and the ghost pepper flavor comes out big time so grab a used spice container fill it up put it in your spice cabinet and start using it it's great on soups stews rice gravy whatever season it and then the rest I'm just gonna put in a big container stored in the cabinet so refill my other one later this makes great Christmas gifts and it also gives you something to do with those leftover peppers you had all year so I hope y'all like the video like subscribe leave a comment questions and I'll see y'all next time